hi guys welcome back to my channel if you are new uh, i'm kenny make sure you subscribe to my channel i'll really appreciate that in today's video i'll be sharing with you how i got these defined flat twist out on my 4ca i hope you enjoyed this video if you do please give me a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel please 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 don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i'll really really appreciate that i'm gonna start by making my living mixture i'll take the canter share butter leave in conditioning with pay cream and i'll add a small amount of that product into warm water in this spray bottle and i'm gonna mix it together i do this because it kind of thin it out and it's easier for me to apply it to my hair like this i'll be starting on freshly cleansed and deep conditioned air i always burn my air like this after washing it after detangling it in the shower so that it doesn't shrink back to its kinky state and it's easy for me to manipulate it once i'm ready to style it so i'm gonna put my air in sections and i'll put my air in the sections in the direction that i want my air to fall into once i take my flat twist out one section on the back and three sections on the front i'll be taking that section of air and i'll start by moisturizing it i'll be spray putting a little bit of the living mixture in there and i'll work it really in like i always say i have to really work products into my hair for them to be easily absorbed because my hair is just that stubborn i'm going to take a more generous amount of the canter share butter coconut curling cream and i'll apply that to my hair to further moisturize it and i'll be slightly detangling my hair as i'm doing that and also i'll be making sure that every bit of my hair is coated with the two moisturizers especially the ends of my hair i'm going to take olive oil and i'll use it to seal in the moisture in there i always moisturize my hair like this because i'll be going in with ecostella gel which is kind which can be kind of drying on air and also i always moisturize my hair like this once in two weeks so i really have to layer my products wisely so that my hair does not get dry after a couple of days so i'm going to take that subsection of hair and i'll detangle it with this pink comb and it's it's advisable that you properly detangle your hair before flat twisting it because you don't want to be dealing with like tangles as you're flat twisting your hair then i'm going to take eco stellar gel and i'm going to apply it to this section of it and i'll flat twist that section of it flat twist is kind of easy it's just like twist and cornrow mixed together i'll take two sections of it and i'll be and i'll twist them around one another and i'll be adding more air as i go along and once i get to the end of the flat twist i'm going to twist the whole length of my hair and twirl the ends one tip i'll give you is that don't make your the section of where you're working on don't make it too big because if you do that the the air you're going to be twisting at the end of the flat twist is going to be too thick and it will be unraveling and it may make you lose core definitions i'll be showing you that again i'll take eco stellar gel apply it to this subsection of air after detangling it and then i'll be flat twisting like i said i'll take two sections of air and i'll be twisting i'll twist them around one another and i'll be adding more section of air as i go along to make sure that the air lays down flat on my head then i'll twist the whole length of my air and throughout the end so it's very very easy if you like me to do a more detailed video on how to flat twist let me know in the comment section below and i'll do that i'll be moving on to the front section and i'll be showing you how i moisturize it again i'll take the leave-in mixture which is the canter share butter leave-in conditioning cream and and warm water and i'll be spritting that into my hair and i'll further moisturize it with the canter share butter coconut curling cream and i'll seal on the moisture with olive oil as you can see my hair is just that difficult products just don't go in there they have to stay on top and be constituting users <laughs> <laughs> so i'm gonna take a subsection of air and i'll be flat twisting that i'll detangle the subsection of air and i'll add eco styler gel which is my styler and i'll flat twist this air so that it falls right into my face because i want the cause for this flat twist for the front section i want them to fall right into my face like bang yeah something like that i'll be swirling the ends once i twist the whole length of my hair for the back section is a little bit more difficult for me because i have to position my hand in a little bit more uncomfortable way especially in the way that i would normally curl my hair i will detangle that subsection of hair after moisturizing it i will detangle that subsection of hair i'm going to add eco styler which is my styler i'm going to add it in there and work it really in and i'll start flat twisting that section of it and to flat twist it like i said i'll be positioning my hand in the in like i want to curl my hair and i'll take two sections of hair and i'll be twisting them into one another and i'll be picking more hair as i go along so that the hair lays down flat on my head yeah that is it flat twist is kind of easy once you can cornrow and twist your hair 
it's a little bit easy so that is it and once i flat twist the whole length of my hair and once i'm done flat twisting i'll twist the whole length of my hair and then i'll twirl the ends this is the whole of my hair once everything is flat twisted and i as you can see i flat twisted my hair in the direction i want my hair to fall into in the direction i want my curls to fall into once i take my hair out i'll be twisting the hair out of my face and i'll be stretching it out a little bit with hair bands because i'll be wearing my hair like this for a couple of days before i take the flat twist out this is my hair my flat twist is completely dry and it's ready to be taken down i'll start by taking out the air bands then i already have olive oil on my palm and i'll be unraveling the flat twist it's kind of easy just unraveling it very very easy Once I'm done unraveling the flat twist, I'll pick the roots of my hair like halfway through because flat twist can be kind of flat on the head and I love my hair to be big and voluminous so I'll be picking that hair to give me more volume yeah so that it's raised and i'm and i have more volume because it's not easy to like separate flat twist curls because they are already like in a separated form not like twist out i don't need to separate the curls so because i picked the root i lost a little bit of definition but that is okay with me because i prefer my head to have volume than for it to be like defined and flat on my head this is another way in which i wear flat twist out it's the um fro ox style flat twist out is easier to style in a fro ox style than any other style because i've already created a bang and it's easy for the air to fall right into my face i'll be uploading a video of how to of how i do my fro ox and every other style that involves a bang very soon so that is it guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you do please don't forget to give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel don't forget to leave me nice comments in the comment section below and i really really appreciate that thank you guys and i'll catch you in my next video bye guys